Hey, so today I want to walk you through a brand new, brand new Squarespace feature, and that is the ability to send images directly from your phone to your website. So you're going to need the Squarespace app on your phone. If I can get this on the screen, you're going to need the Squarespace app, and then you're also going to we're going to be working here within the Squarespace platform on our computer. So you're going to need your computer and your phone, but it's going to be super easy. So let's walk you through it. First things first, I've set up a little space here where you can see I've just put in a little bit of information. Let's use the Squarespace app and an image block. So again, if you don't know how to find an image block, they're right here in the insert point. Now Squarespace is going to be redesigning this a little bit here soon, but it'll still be um, an image block that we're using here, right? So then you click to add an image to that and you can do that from either the pencil and then hit the plus or just hit the plus. And then you see here, this is new. It says upload from mobile. So let's click that. And you can see it says, we've sent you a push notification. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to show you what this looks like on my phone. And there it is. We're going to open that up and you can see it has added loads and loads of images and I'll show you this and from there you can go through your recent photos we can go to a folder so I've got one of all my business photos and pop in a photo I'm going to click that upload it and it's still it's thinking over here so it is uploading and there we go now that image is uploading into my website how stinking cool is that and then from there we can go ahead and design it like we do any other image i can say that i want this to be a shape and i want it to be a circle and it will do that once it gets its mind straight so i'm going to hit save and there we go there's that circle um every once in a while there's a little glitch but it essentially is just just hit save refresh the page let it know where you're at and you're not going to have any issues all right let me know if you like this new feature Tell me what you think. If there's any improvements that I can pass on, let me know.